All right, so today is the day, and we're going to be starting pretty soon here. And uh, any final last minute predictions? I predict that we're going to see Smash Brothers. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. No, I can't. I can't think of anything at the fucking seven o'clock in the morning. Oh God. <laughs> I. You were gonna go get something, right? There we go. Now all my alarms are off. I'll just cut to when the direct starts. In fact, I should probably save myself. It's starting! <laughs> it's, it's I'd be more excited, but it is, it is 6 o'clock in the morning. Or 7 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Alright. Super Smash Brothers! So we're not starting with the character reveal. Hello. Hello. Uh, this we is might. Well, I mean, like, exactly start with And the this is assignment. the final Nintendo Direct before the launch of Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. So Wait. far, we've confirmed final 72 fighters. Yeah. 74, if you count... Like, no, well, no, I think... Three. Our entire I think it's team just... worked really hard. <laughs> With this Nintendo Direct, we'll have revealed every fighter you can find in the game. Okay, uh, let's do this. Yeah, see, opening with a fighter. I, I was meaning, like, without even showing him first, like they did with Simon. Mm -hmm. Well, <laughs> there's Ken. Oof. Ooh, Little Mac just got slammed. So they did open with Ken, so... Bring it on. Sweet. Here comes a new challenger! It is totally Incineroar. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Honestly, I already like Incineroar more than I did in Pokemon. We finally revealed all of the fighters you'll find in the game. This is the initial fighter select screen. <laughs> yeah. There aren't very many at first, but it is the same amount with as the, the original, original Nintendo 64 game. You don't even get Fox. And once you've that's... unlocked them all. You get Fox. No, 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 you don't start with them, though. He, he was there. Was he? It I, don't, like I missed him. It... Damn. It may seem hard to guess where each one's located, but they're sorted by number and the order they join the series. Except me, Brawler. And Dark Samus. No, uh, the Echo fighters, fighters are. Uh, because they're technically right, the same can... number, they're next to their original fighters. The new Splatoon to me, though. The Ridley one looks really nice. Hmm. We determined the collectible trophies wouldn't be a great fit for this game. Oh wow, they're Honestly, gone. They were really difficult to develop too. That said, the Super Smash Brothers series is one massive crossover at heart, and we want to create something more. A way to enjoy characters other than fighters from a ver variety of video games. My dad games. thinks we stayed up all night. Here's what we came up with. They're called spirits. Well then. Hence their powers. There's a massive amount of wildly different spirits. Zero. One for every single Pokemon. There are several <laughs> classes of spirits. Standard spirits are dubbed novices. Stronger ones have the title advanced. Especially strong ones are called aces. And some... Uh, Kanoka? Who's that? <laughs> of course. King DDD with Gordos. It's invisible oh, King DDD. Oh god. 
and there's three of them. Yeah. And they only use Gordo. Oh my god, no. God, man. It's like the boss fight. It's your, your tiny Greninja fighting giant Gutsman. You're not tiny. Yeah, you are. He is giant. He is giant. But you're not tiny. Mm. Oh my god. He has an Owain costume. <laughs> and that's all he does. <laughs> he just does. Oh god, no. <laughs> giant K. I don't want to fight at least in prison he, at anymore. Least, oh no. And it's gear oh, it's demise and Gearham. Wait. Who is that? What? Yeah. I can't remember where she's from. But it's a me sword fighter. In Animal Crossing, going with Sonic. Well, because they're hedgehogs. Yeah, it's because you're fighting the Able Sisters. Yeah. Who are hedgehogs? That's that's what I said. It's the hedgehogs. Sonic is not a they. A new skip. So I'm guessing there are at least some spirits you can only get you can through. Also train spirits. It's, it's like fusion. Smash Brothers is now Persona. Or send them out in search of treasure, which they'll bring back to you. These seem like unlikely teams of characters. Off the hook. Each team could be somebody's dream come true. Sean. Training and exploring can to yield results, even while playing other modes or after turning off the game. So if you send out your spirits, just let them do their thing. Certain spirits are known as masters. You can beat them to unlock facilities. Gravity, man. Spirits can also be used to power up amiibo figure players. Of course they can. You must bid them farewell, but you can repeat the process multiple times. Peach just ate Wispy Woods. It's one great big Sever, uh, of characters from many different There's cities. a Shy Guy one. Just, I am in Smash Brothers. Yay. You made it. <laughs> <laughs> See, there's like a bunch of Mega Man ones and this makes me happy. There's Sigma right there and everything. Yeah. Whenever you fight against the spirit, the final smash meter is enabled. Oh. Cool. Probably so they can use it. Dude. That is Yoshi's final smash. That's Yoshi's final smash and it's calling back to melee. Another way to put it? The spirit would lets you simulate battles between characters from more series than ever before. You can enjoy many unbelievable combinations and situations. The power of enemy and ally spirit teams is displayed here. They have so many Xenoblade characters. This is the best <laughs> game ever. Stronger spirit teams make it easier to just You know there's going to be people that are like, I'm going to do it without any spirits. And they upload it to YouTube, like, friggin... Yeah, I imagine spirits, spirits will be like... The more your power overshadows theirs, the less you'll be rewarded. It pays oh. for a fair fight. The total number of assist trophies is now 59. Actually, they outnumber the Pokemon this time. What? The assist trophies who can be KO'd can also be defeated by the fighter who summoned them just before they're KO'd. That way, you won't lose a point to the other player. You're useless. Stab. Now, I'd like to cover a variety of other features in the game. Jesus Christ, Sakurai. Help. If you want to review the controls for game mode, press the ZR button to open the dashboard and look in here. There are all kinds. But there are even more coming post launch. <sighs> While we've already implemented a huge roster wonder, of fighters, no. this is the Super Smash Brothers series, which means we're leaving the opportunity open to add in more fighters as paid DLC. I wonder if they'll reveal any today. Since we already included every fighter from the past games, that means there are no more fighters to include unless we develop new fighters from scratch. And we're not talking about Echo Fighters. We'll be developing and selling sets that will include one fighter, one stage, and multiple music tracks. 
That's a pretty good deal for this set. Yeah. For $5.99. I mean, that's for five bucks. But, US, so that's like eight dollars, maybe. Yeah. Which, um, let's be honest, that's what I'm getting. Fighters. Yeah. Five stages. Oh, so there's five DLC. Cool. By the end of February 2020. Ideally, we should reveal what's included before it becomes available for purchase. However, please allow us to offer this pass before we're ready to reveal its contents. I hope only those who are confident in its value will purchase it. Again, the price is twenty four ninety nine for all that's, five sets. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's really now that good. We finally confirmed the development of this DLC. Please know that we'll be working really hard on it. I wonder if I'll ever get to take a break. Oh God! By the way, here's one purchase bonus you'll get with the Fighters Pass. Final Fantasy? Yes! <laughs> I mean, I'm also sad, but you know what? <laughs> yeah. We decided which fighters to include when we started planning, so we couldn't add characters from titles like Xenoblade Chronicles 2, which was announced after planning had started. I hope this yeah. update will help us. But then also, there's also Xenoblade 2 music in the game. Including some music from the Xenoblade Chronicles series. Give it a listen at Gower Plains sometime. Other Xenoblade Chronicles series. Zeke is. Oh my god. Yay! I'm just happy that we I get to do that. The paid DLC, and we haven't locked down any release dates, but we'll start working on them as soon as we're finished with the main game. It may take around a year or so to finish releasing all the DLC. But it's about how long it took. We're currently developing something. Something you'll get for free as a limited time what? offer if you buy the Super Smash Brothers Ultimate game now. It isn't finished yet. But I want to give you a special sneak peek. What is it? I'm so... Mario looks pissed. It's a Bowser costume? No, it's not. No, it's a... It's a limited time character. It looks like Bowser, though. It had one of his moves. The recovery was hilarious. That's right. Piranha Plant will take root in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, and not as an assist trophy, but as an actual fighter. It can spit poison, fire off spiky balls, and perform long-range attacks. This tricky character is full of surprises. Its final smash is TD Piranha. If you get caught in the cage, well, let's just say it won't end well for you. Piranha Plant is scheduled for completion after the launch of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. We've gotten a little head start on it, but it probably won't be ready until a couple of months after launch. Please stay tuned. Remember, Piranha Plant is a free, limited time offer. For the physical version of the game, you only need to go through the My Nintendo Gold Point registration process to receive it. I hope you'll consider pre-ordering. Too We're late, already then. <laughs> It has a nice curved oh. form to it. So, okay, Later so today you'll be able to pre-purchase the game after finishing this Nintendo device. I hope you go to Nintendo eShop or Nintendo.com before you forget. He's not forgetting. I have an announcement for everyone watching this in North America. What? On our official site, you can find information for a variety of upcoming hands-on events. Participants will have a chance to try out all 74 fighters, so please check out the website to find out where we'll show up next, and more. Please. That's it for the last Nintendo Direct for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate before the game launches. But before we go... That's so. 
I should mention that the adventure mode in this game is nothing like what we came up with for the subspace emissary. That said, what exactly caused all these characters to lose their bodies and transform into spirits? I'll show you how it all begins and leave the rest to your imagination. We're gonna okay, get a then, kick -ass please look forward to the game's release. Don't let a single one get away. Hey, Brawl. Oh my god. Hey, Brawl. <laughs> the hell is that? Um? What? We'll each need to take down about ten. Don't your fear. It's now or never. We'll win this. I know we will. Um, what is this? It looks so cool. <laughs> Poor Shulk. <laughs> they tried so hard. Oh. Nope. <laughs> Perfect. Sure, I'm glad that we fit trainer was useful there. Oh god. And then the original eight probably managed to like, get, get away. away. Right, it's not even the original eight, because Ness and Luigi will be unlockable. Yeah. Well, no, they're they're not part of the eight. Um, after you unlock everyone, it's twelve. Oh, okay, yeah, that's true. I think Evan is messaging me, going, "Oh my god!" My <laughs> battery just woke up. We have to save Dark Knight. It makes me so sad that Shulk saw that happening. Oh my god, they gave the lyrics. This is amazing. Who is this? I know them. I'm not sure. I love it. So this is how you all... Oh, oh. Hey, Brawl. Uh, oh. Metal Mario? So no, you, you start you start as Kirby. Yeah. That's it. In the adventure mode, anyways. You'll still have that it. Is terrifying. I really hope that there's more cutscenes like that, though. Yeah, that'd be so cool. This is the this is the best game. <laughs> yeah. That's like a that's straight out of Final Fantasy. It looked like almost. I fucking love this song. Shantae, there you go. Keep Smash Bros. How do you think I feel? Rex was, <laughs> Rex is a V fighter. Hey, I remember Paul. you. <laughs> okay, so World of Light. Am hype. <laughs> I am I like I'm sad that the characters I wanted didn't get revealed. Yeah. But also, I I'm not gonna complain because, uh, I mean, like, yeah. Number one, I wasn't gonna complain because of the roster. 
like immediately, but like yeah. That that mode literally makes up for everything. Yeah, like, it looks so cool, and I love that he like addressed the fact that Shulk has visions of it. Yeah. So like, Shulk is the only one that knew that was coming. He's like, he just looks back and he's like, fuck, <laughs> like, he can't do anything. That makes me so sad, though. There's no audio. We want sound. We, we want, want sound. sound. We, we want, want sound. <laughs> we want sound. <laughs> there it is. It's just very quiet. No, there are. Thanks. <laughs> I don't know if we want to... Yeah, I, I'll i just film whatever happens. Like, if something crazy gets, ends up happening during this. Right. Okay. But otherwise, we'll talk about this in a minute. Yeah. <laughs> this, we have to, we have to film the cat. It's too dark. <laughs> Dim the light! <laughs> cat. Okay, that's all we wanted. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. So as you saw, we were at Camden's, and actually, we didn't end up uh, doing our discussion about the Smash Direct. We certainly talked about it a lot, but we didn't actually film it. Um, I think we're gonna do like a real one. Um, but. Anyway, that's not what this is about. As you saw, we were at Camden's, and now it's time to head to bed. It's actually, I've been trying to go to bed for a while now. And right as I was about to head to bed, um, I heard this buzzing noise. And then I kind of looked around, and there was a moth in, like, in this, this coin thing. And he was just, like, sitting there. And I picked it up to, like, um, basically, you know, let him out. And then, like, he just starts moving around a lot, and then, like, he starts, like, knocking coins onto himself. And I had to, like, get rid of all I had to take all the coins out of it. And then, then take them over to the window, throw them out the window, in the jar, and put all the coins back. So, yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna head to bed now. Um, I'm, we're gonna film the Smash Direct... Uh, basically discussions tomorrow, um, whether it be, you know, big fancy thing over Discord or more like today's reactions. Also, I've listened to the main theme that they introduced in that uh, direct a million times. My cat wants in. See you guys tomorrow. <laughs>